The United States Constitution doesn't guarantee a right to appeal judicial decisions. But in Griffin v. Illinois, the Supreme Court established that once a state provides a right of appellate review, a criminal defendant can't be denied an appeal simply because he can't afford a transcript. In MLB v. SLJ, the court considered whether Griffin applies in the civil context to a parent facing a termination of parental rights. In 1992, MLB and SLJ divorced. The couple's two minor children remained with SLJ. SLJ remarried, and in 1993, he and his new wife, JPJ, brought an action in Mississippi Chancery Court to terminate MLB's parental rights and allow JPJ to adopt the children. The Chancery Court entered a decree terminating MLB's parental rights, stating that MLB's relationship with the children had deteriorated due to MLB's neglect, abuse, and absence. The decree also stated that SLJ and JPJ had met their burden of proof by clear and convincing evidence. However, the decree didn't detail that evidence or explain the basis for the Chancellor's decision. Mississippi provides civil litigants a right to appeal, but to argue that the trial court's conclusion wasn't supported by the evidence, the potential appellant has to pay for preparing the trial court record and sending it to the appellate court. MLB tried to appeal the Chancery Court's decree, but she couldn't afford the record preparation fee. She sought leave to appeal as a poor person, but the Mississippi Supreme Court denied her request, and her appeal was dismissed. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.